entering our showcase of Catholic high schools throughout Kentucky. Today we are at DeSales High School in Louisville and one interesting thing about this school is they actually have a STEM program. A program that's all dedicated to anything STEM from robotics, all of that. So right now I'm going to be talking to some administrators and some students. I'm joined right now with Principal Anastasia Court and one of the teachers here, TJ Cataldo. So, wow. Tell me about this STEM center that we're in and the STEM program. Absolutely. One of the great things is um, we're not just a STEM program, we're a STEM school. So that means that we are certified in STEM in every classroom from theology, history, uh, you know, to the science and the math as well. Um, and that just means that students are engaged fully in the learning. Tell me about your curriculum and um, other programs that you all have here. Curriculum here is tough but fair. Mm -hmm. And all these teachers, we have the opportunity to mold it to how we see best or what the students need. So I know that this school is um, sometimes referred to as a South End school, but you all actually pull from a lot of different areas. Tell me about that. Yeah, 42 different zip codes actually. So all over uh, Louisville Metro, but then even beyond that. Um, we're diverse in our populations, in our ethnicities, but we're also diverse in our learners, um, in the activities that the students participate in. Let's talk about some of the students that you all have right now and how are you preparing them for once they graduate and walk across the stage? So we do a lot and we work very well as a team of teachers and student services team and administrators to make sure that we are providing the students for any avenue that they are interested in. Some of those may not be directly at the sales, um, but giving them outlets uh, to be themselves, uh, providing emotional intelligence training, helping them to prepare for stresses that come later in life, helping them to prepare for leadership roles. Um, we have activities and sessions that are very specific to what does it mean to be a man in the world today? What does it mean to be moral and ethical and responsible so that when you go out into the community, you are truly a leader in the community. So we're turning the spotlight now on the students here at DeSales High School. I'm joined by three right now. So I'm with Randy Rivas, he's a senior here, Zach Quirk, and he's a senior as well, and Mac Eckhoff, who is a sophomore. So that's gonna be an interesting experience. I'll be able to hear all about you all. So first question, you guys, why did you choose this school? Well, I chose this sales because I really saw the opportunity to get involved with a lot of things. Uh, you know, I've been involved in so many different clubs, um, and I love every second of it. Well, tell me about you. Yeah, I came here for this small environment. I know everybody in my grade. I know a lot of juniors. I just know a little everybody. And like other schools just don't have that, mm -hmm. that personal connection. And then I have that same thing with my teachers as well. That's good. And then what about you? I chose the school for the community that it brings along with the positive attitude and the environment, of course, because you don't get a lot of environment to have closeness with everybody in the school compared to other schools where we can come together collectively as one giant group and call ourselves brothers. So I heard you all talking off camera, so I know that you all are involved in a lot of activities and already preparing for college. So tell me, what kind of activities are you in? So. I love academic and athletic. Uh, I wrestle, play lacrosse, ran cross country. Um, I'm involved in student government, the academic team, the key club. Um, Joseph Arimathea is a, a great club. That's nice. What about you? I'm similar to Zach. I like to do everything here, but um, I'm the setter for varsity volleyball, mm -hmm. uh, bass fishing. Uh, I did cross country last year. Uh, bowling now. It's just, they have so many opportunities. I, just, I can do so much different stuff, like intramurals and everything. Yeah, it sounds like you all stay busy. So what about you? What are you involved in? So I've done the academic team and Governor's Cup, along with, I ran cross country last year. I'm going to do track this year in the spring. Played baseball for two years. I've done, I've been in the Spanish club, St. Joseph of Arimathea, and Key Club, for sure. So as you hear, they are having a great experience, learning so much, um, being involved in a lot of activities, and there's really a sense of community here at this school. So if you are interested in enrolling your student here or want to just learn more about the Sales High School, you can reach out to Justin Lewis or register online at www.thesaleshighschool.com.